flicker. Lots of flickers. Lots of flickers. And... Ayaw nila tatlong flicker. Meron well, wala kay... man nang isang naka-purify. Ah. Meron kay... Uh, alam mo yun, kasi yung purify, it's... It doesn't really solve the problem. Eh. Nandun ka pa rin kayo sa vicinity. Mahuhulit, mahuhulit ka din. Mahuhulit ka pa rin. Oh. So, ibig sabihin, meron si uh, Yu Zhong na flicker dito. Si uh, Kripsu meron din at si Lins. Let's go into this game. Game 2, NXP Solid versus Blue Fire. Mal close out na kaya ng NXP to. And I think it's a good possibility considering right now, they look like they have a pretty comfortable pick still. Pero I still kind of miss the YSS here. Pero let's see if H2 can make the Hayabusa work. Round two, two times the charm, close it out. Mm -hmm. And uh, looking at it, ito ah, may malaking emphasis dito into getting the level four para sa mga supports. NXP solid, kailangan nila ibigay agad kay Chang o yung meteor shower nila because they know that they need that certain buff para dito. Uh, kaya they need that certain uh, skill pala para kay uh, Chang o. But looking at it, tignan mo sila H2O dito kung ano ginawa nila. They went straight for that orange buff sa my side ng kalaban. Uy, Chester, grabe naman. Galit na galit. Laban agad. And Kripsu, very, very low. Lives in front as well. Looks like Bluefire is now going to be the ones on the driver's seat mm -hmm. with the first blood on H2O. And that is going to be the first blood. And titignan mo dito, the thing na nangyari dito for the side of Bluefire, they went straight for that purple buff and they go for another punish blue fire dito getting two kills wow and man oh man that is going to be big kills onto the side of nxp solid that was a delay on h2o yeah and laking bagay nung delay din as well as the buffs i'm not sure if h2o still has any buffs in that one because na clear out siya so it's gonna be a long early game here for nxp oh mb getting the shorter end of the stick doon sa engagement na yun. And that is going to be another pick-up for the side of Blue Fire. Ito yung sinasabi natin. Merong glimmer of hope mm -hmm. for the side of Blue Fire. May Kasi asin. nakukuha nila oh. yung rotation nila sa early game. Hindi lang nila napapanghawakan yun against sa side ng NXP Solid. And I think doon lumalakas. Doon, doon, uh, ang tawag doon, doon nagpapakitang gilas yung NXP. Yung after nitong early game nito, even though mabehind kami, paano ba kami makabawi? Mm -hmm. ba diba? So, abangan nyo yun mga kaibigan. And NXP looks like gusto nilang i-offset yung weaknesses ni Hayabusa by grouping up together sa mid lane. So, magtitrio muna kami, ikot muna kami. Hindi muna pwede yung solo-solo. Okay. Na. So, ako naniniwala nga ako, Rocker, kailangan mag-ingat ni Cripso dito eh. There were a lot of kills given kay H2O dahil nauhuli niya si Cripso kanina. So, feeling ko medyo kailangan, ano, kailangan maiwan dito or... Uh, Mag-isip dito si Kripsu kung paano niya ipapwesta yung sarili niya. Because earlier, talaga nauhuli siya na siya lang yung mismong target ng shadow kill. Mm -hmm. And Kripsu is going to be, I think this time around, a bit safer. Kasi Fuzaken's gonna be, sa, nakita niyo nangyayari kanina eh, di ba? Mm -hmm. So Fuzaken's going to be more alert and blocking out para kay Kripsu. And yung value talaga, it makes... It's very difficult to deal with. Mm -hmm. Like, kita mo naman, even NXP, nagkakagamit lang ng Valir. They're having a hard time dealing with Crips, although right now, hindi sila nag-amaasin masyado. Mm, that is actually a good observation from Rockheart. Still, there is this thing about Blue Fire na ito din yung ginawa nila kanya. Ito. They still go for it, and the retributions are thrown out. The question is, kayawi yung, kay, well, kayawi actually napunta yung buff. Oh. Kayawi na punta yung buff. So, ibig sabihin, uh, pinerksa nila si H2, they gumamit ng retribution. Uh. They got something out of it, but still, kayawi na punta eh. You would actually prefer na mapunta yun kay H2, pero a kill onto the top lane dito kay MB. And another kill onto the middle lane doon sa may side brush netong mid lane na to. They actually get two kills at that point at different points of the map limbs dito nagiging aggressive na i think blue fire is being confident sa lahat ng ginagawa nila sa ngayon diba i think alam nilang kaya naman natin mag-survive and wala masyadong threat kay H2O kasi right now he's only level 6 with creep chu already at level 8 creep chu creep chu creep chu ah well creep that could chew. be actually a uh, combination pero mapipilitan si Yawi dito <laughs> gamitin niya flicker and uh, that is still going to be a thing na kailangan bantayan and there is going to be a pause. Saan kaya nanggagaling yung apoy ng Bluefire na ganito? No? Kasi sa Balir. Sa Balir. 
Mm. Talaga, no? Tsaka kay Limbs. Oo oh, naman. Yung, yung, so, yung side lane ni Limbs, it's actually surprising na he's winning on that lane considering katapat niya is medyo solid din na side laner. Mm. What you really have to look out for kasi dito kay Alice is yung flowing blood. After the flowing blood, I don't really think that he can out-damage itong isang uh, Thumbs. Kasi oh. yung Thumbs, innately, kaya niya din mag-region para sa sarili niya eh. So, Nahirapan looking at it, siya, looking at it, dapat nananalo talaga dito si Limbs. And this is good for Limbs. Kasi kahit pa paano, week 1 to week 4, hindi niya makuha yung confidence niya, hindi niya mapakita yung lakas niya talaga dito. But right now, at least he's given, uh, ano mo yun, breathing room, kumbaga, para makapag, uh, makapag-set up kahit pa paano. Pero kasi, ang kailangan bantayan dito for NXP Solid is nag scale kasi sila. Yun, yun. I think, especially, even if lumamang si Secret, I said choose sa early game, kayang mahabol. I think we've seen H2O na paulit-ulit na nakabawi siya from big mm-hmm. deficits. Just, that's just the nature of H2O, no? Mm-hmm. Nature na niya na makabawi in eventually as long as the game can progress pero, into the ka- late game. Pero kasi kailangan din, hindi din bigyan ng blue fire na pagkakataon makabawi si H2O kasi nakita nila yung game number one, yung Chang O, tinarget ng tinarget, hindi makalaban si Chang O, and that led to them actually giving back the ball or napasa nila uli yung bola dito sa side ng NXP Solid. So, now, hinahanap ni H2O yung opening na yun. I'm sure hinahanap niya yun sa side niya. He's trying to get it from uh, from Crypt. Kasi alam natin si Crypt talaga dito, yung pinakamagandang target for him. So right now, they're looking at it. Nag, nag-iisip na sila kung paano nga ba natin lulustan to. For you, if, if gusto dito ng NXP Solid makabawi dito sa deficit na binigay sa kanila ng Blue Fire, how do you deal with this? Para makabawi sa deficit nila right now, I think you just need to spam the ano, spam the wave clear. No, mm-hmm. I think I think the wave clear is so important, and he need you will have to concede some objectives. At this point, he di pag pinoy sa nila lumaban, they will definitely lose. Like what's happening right now? Oh, Chester Don getting two on that ultimate fatal links. Ang ganda sana, pero there was no follow-up. Wala si Rene J doon, and that is going to be a pick-off onto the side of Bluefire. Ito lang yung pinaka nagiging story dito. Bluefire umiikot, NXP na uhuli. Yep. Over and over again, they just need to avoid fighting, and they need to get H2O. Kailangan nila ma-focus yung farm ni H2O. Right now, pati si Secret lamang na sa kanya si Lemon. Mm-hmm. Turtle, kinukuha dito. Look at Secret. He's actually trying to zone out itong mga tao dito. And this is bad for the side of NXP Solid. Kapag kayo mga side laners pinuntahan nung carry at sila yung nabubuli, even if it's a 2v1, medyo dun na nagkakaroon ng Delegates. clear lead. Kasi kung titignan mo dito ngayon, in terms of gold, 6k ang kalamangan dito ng Blue Fire. 6k gold at 5 and a half minutes. Napakabilis nun. That is scary, especially if right now we chew on that turtle buff. Na ako po na pahabde nito dance level 11. Kaya kaya na magtake down ng mga low level targets, especially level six ng siyawi ngayon. That is not good for NXP. Chester dito pulling the trigger on that ultimate, and that is going to be the opening na hinahanap dito ng blue fire. This might be a push going to their side, and probably. Another objective na minamata nila sa baba kasi nung nakita nilang ginamit yung Fatal Link, sabi, it's go time. Snap na. Oras na, oras na. Laban, laban. Wala nang ulti. Mm-hmm. You know what's super surprising dito? Is sinasadya ba nila mag-swap role ngayon si Yowie tsaka si Chester? No? But possible. Kasi kung, na, kung, nababa, kung nakikita mo kung paano mag-tank dito yung uh, two players, I think this is the certain adjustment na binigay sa kanila ng team. Interesting. Kumbaga, Yawi ikaw magano, Yawi ikaw mag-support. Ikaw mag-chang-o, ikaw gumamit nito lahat. Si Chester yung magiging initiator natin. Tignan natin Nasa captain, pinapakita ni Chester na versatile siya. Pero look at this ultimate. Ito na ata ang hinahanap na laban mga kaibigan ng Blue Fire. Pero look at this. The damage just way too low to the side of NXP Solid. Hindi nila kinakaya. Chu dito, tinusok-tusok si MB. Tusok-tusok. Ako po. Ito na yung puncture-puncture. <laughs> okay, so... Kamusta naman si Chu? I think maximum na yung ultimate niya. Phantom Execute will hurt even mm-hmm. more. Ang gagiging problema dito is how do you take this down? How do you chase this? Let's see. Uh, look at the Judah instant replay. Yung front line ng Blue Fire this time, mas solid compared to last game. Mm-hmm. And uh, looking at this replay, nakita mo doon na talagang naisip na nila na gusto nila kunin yung laban na yun kasi ang ganda ng Fatal Links eh. But the thing is, 
yung combo mo wala. Yung combo mo wala doon. It could have been Renny J at that point on, dealing damage. At si Crypto dito nakuha na yung kanyang Durant. Yep, hindi ba natin nakita yung wombo combo ng NXP? Yung ano, yung ulti, yung fatal links into uh, into Yawi, into Renny J, wala pang ganun kasi hindi pa sila confident and nakakatakot yung assassination capabilities nitong si Chu sa Lancelot. Mm -hmm. So hindi sila makaset up na maayos. So now, yung mapa nandito na side ng, uh, nasa side ng Blue Fire. NXP solid dito, they're trying to regain it back pero kasi talagang nakaset up na dito yung Blue Fire na sila na ang magbamando na itong laro. Chester, nahuli siya sa isang masamang lugar and that is going to be an overextend. But look at this, H2O, hindi niya alam kung saan siya magdi-def. Ang daming nangyayari sa mapa dito. Looking at it, Renny J, hindi pa siya nakakasali sa isang laban dito. Hindi pa talaga kasi hindi din siya makas makapasok ng solid. I don't think kompleto pa yung winter truncheon niya. And even if mag-winter truncheon ka sa gitna ng kalaban mo, what if you're not doing enough damage? Mm -hmm. Hindi ka din makakasurvive. Yun siguro iniisip niya kaya hindi siya makapasok talaga. Hirap na ang NXP mga kaibigan with an 11k gold. May, may requirement kasi na kailangan si Alice dito para makapasok siya. Kailangan makita niya muna na natulak na ni Kripsu. Oo, kasi sayang na yung pasok niya kung gano'n. Pagka, na, pagka nag-flowing blood siya, umabot siya dun sa mga tao at natulak siya ni Kripsu. Wala din. There is a chance na baka mawala yung buong ultimate niya at hindi maging komportable na yung buong team niya na lumaban just because nawala yung ultimate niya na yun. Yeah, hindi din siya maka-lifesteal kasi tinulak siya out of place. Wala, mm -hmm. wala siya position. And Chester dito, siya na naman na napakusahan. That was a very good ultimate coming out from him pero hindi talaga mabakapan. Fuzakin dito actually getting a lot of those slashes sa shadow kill pero it's not really enough hindi talaga tumatama or hindi tumutugma yung damage output dito ng NXP solid sa kailangan nila I think sobrang kulang nung overall magic damage nila from Rene J and Gawi and so this, kung may papanalong mm -hmm. game ang blue fire ngayong season na to ulit ito na siguro yun and this could be the stop sa drought na nangyayari sa side ng blue fire they're actually going for the lord H2O na sa may vicinity they actually locate him And this is going to be the Lord going to the side of Blue Fire. Tignan natin kung paano gagalaw dito yung side ng NXP Solid. How will they deal with this? Puzakin dito, humaharap siya sa lahat. And 1-0-8, wala pang napapatay dito yung side ng NXP Solid. Zero kills so far. At 10 minutes, 13,000 na ang lamang ng Blue Fire. At naglalakad ng Lord sa top lane, mga kaibigan. Ito na ba yun? Well, ang tanong ah, Blue Fire, ah, kaya ba nila ma-close out to? Kasi yun din isa sa mga weakness ng Blue Fire nakit natin mula pa nung unang mm -hmm. This could go to a game number three. Right now, tinitignan natin yung stats, Rockheart, tinitignan natin yung game, yung pacing. It's safe to say. It's probably safe to say that pwedeng pumunta to sa game number three kasi yung lead, 15k. Yung towers, 6 to 0. Yung lord, 0 mm. to 1. Malaking bagay yun. Malaking bagay yun. Tignan natin ah. Here we go again for the Siege top lane. Lord, ito na ba ang laban na hinahanap ng Blue Fire? Mm -hmm. Camera, let's go. Camera, let's go. Pero <laughs> nandito, nandito si Chester sa may gitna. Natulak siya pa balik. They go in. Chester dito pinarusahan na naman. Chu on the back lines. Na-take na down na nila dito yung Atlas and they don't want more. They go straight for the next turret. Dito sa may gitna, is this the way na hinahanap nila? Rene J dito pumasok ng uh, blood o. But still, that is not going to be enough. H2O will go down. Chu dito, going ham. Phantom execution. Tignan natin mga kaibigan. Rene J dito, pinipilit niya lang kontrolin yung side dito ng Blue Fire. But Rene J can't really do anything kasi hindi pa siya nag scale Not scaled enough. Minion wave. Minion wave lang. This... Minion wave. Minion wave. Walang minions. And they will be able to defend. At least for now, Yawi left alone. Chester, 2v5 mga kaibigan. This might be it, ladies and gentlemen. Walang minions dito. Nagagawa na NXP Solid na i-delay yung mga bagay-bagay dito for the side of Blue Fire. Pero they cannot go for another pickup dito. If Ito they naman? do, magkakaroon sila ng problema. Yawi dito, do minions? a great job. Pero hindi yata kakayanin. Blue Fire, Blue Fire wins game number 2.